GTI fans, welcome back to another episode of Empyrean Galactic Survival. This is your host, Zelot, and we are here today doing the Alpha 9 series. Uh, today, you can see there's the snow planet there. Um, so we grabbed our stuff from the snow planet. We I headed to the moon, as you can see, because I wanted to get some magnesium, and it's been a pain in the ass to find. I've only found one chunk of it. Um, but that's okay. The, the one chunk will be good enough to get by on. We do have missiles on this thing still. We've still got 400. Okay. So, um, we don't have a lot of gear. We, we don't have squat, really. We haven't done any POIs. There's two real easy POIs here. Uh, I'm not sure what this one is. Uh, there's a, that one's not so easy. Uh, we only have medium armor. We don't really have any boost to speak of. So I want to go assault these. I'm going to take out their exterior defenses. And then we're going to bring the CV to them. And uh, assault them by hand to take out the core. So basically my rule on myself that I'm applying on myself in this playthrough is. If a POI has a spawner that you um that okay let's say let's say there's spawners and turrets on the inside then you also have to kill the core from the inside by by hand weapons but if there's no spawners at all and if there's no interior turrets so if there's if you can just walk up to the core and shoot it i don't I don't think it's an issue if I just shoot it with my vehicle then. You know what I'm saying? It's not It's not like it's increasing or decreasing the difficulty. It's just all you're doing is just saving a bit of time by using your vehicle. So this one I know has spawners on the inside of it. Which one is this? This is a power station. So I know it has spawners on the inside and turrets on the inside. So... That means I'm going to have to storm it by foot to take out the core. That's the rule. I can't just I can't just shoot through a couple blocks, pop the core, wander in, and loot it. I'm going to have to actually pop the core by hand. Unless it is a POI that has no interior defenses and no interior... Um, spawners okay so do I have my f6 yep and it's shooting right now okay so let's get over this side and we're gonna come at it from an angle oh I didn't know he could get such an extreme angle Okay, so let's just straighten out a little bit here. Now that it can't actually see us, what we're going to do is we're going to take out the, the drones as we get close enough. I'm not going to piss around with shooting them. I'm just going to take them out with missiles. We've got enough missiles and then... So I'm just going to sneak in some shots. Right like this and try and did I, I think I got it actually. Yep. I one shot it. Okay. So the exterior defenses are free game, including exterior spawners. So let's switch to our guns. I don't think the power station has any exterior um, sentry guns, but I'm pretty sure it has a spawner. In fact, I'm positive it does. So I think we can actually take out the spawner by our own laws, our own policy. I thought it was right here somewhere. 
No? Okay. I guess there's no more spawner on the exterior? Oh yes, there is, right there. Okay. So, there's that one stripped of its defenses. So we can bring the CV over to that. Let's fly down to the other one now while I have the ship out. This thing was actually a pain in the ass to jump in to get into from the CV. <laughs> How I had it parked. It was, a, it was a little tricky. Okay, supply station is next. Let's head down to the supply station. We haven't really done any POI assaulting at all. I think these might be the very first two. And I chose them because they're super easy POIs that we can that we can get loot at. And even if we die, uh, we'll have the CV right here marked as our home. Hmm, something over here. That's okay. We don't have to reveal everything on this map. This act, this moon is actually quite massive. Okay, so there it is there. Now I'm pretty sure it has, it has sentry guns and spawners. So what I want to do is I want to take out the sentry guns, obviously first. Now, I know there's one right down here. Oh, we gotta take out the, uh, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm getting shot at right now. Okay, so that's, that's the issue. Okay, so I know that, wow, these things have, what's my range, 470, holy crap, 470. I know there's one like right there. <laughs> Okay, let's get this guy. Okay. Now, I'm not sure if there's any more sentry guns. There's more drones. Okay, it looks like I took out the... Oh, no, 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 what am I... What am I doing? I'm getting attacked. Can't be getting attacked. Get out of my face. Okay. So, I know there's spawners. Let's switch to our mini guns. I'm not sure where they are, though. Oh, there's a... Okay. There was a sentry. I thought I had taken that out, but I guess I missed. I'm not sure what I took out. It looks like just a block beside it. Nice. Okay, so... Is there a... Don't know if there's any spawners there. Oh, there's a spawner. Okay. Oh, uh oh, what am I getting shot at? What am I getting shot by? There was a guy that just spawned, so what do we, where'd he go? Here he comes. Okay, so he spawned. He spawned from an invisible block that could not be shot. So he's one of those one-time spawner blocks. Okay, that's fine. He's dead. Oh, there's another... There's another spawner. I saw it there. Right there. Okay, it looks like the exterior defenses on this are now neutralized. Let's take a look. 
Yeah, I don't see any more sentry guns. Okay. Okay, let's go get... I will go get the CV and I will meet you back at the power station. Okay, we are back. And I think I've got myself all ready to go. I've, I've put the uh, whole mole away. And we are parked in front of the power station. Uh, let's go. I have equipped myself. I only have medium armor. But I do have two armor boosts that I was able to equip and I put on a mobility boost. That's about the best I can do for armor right now. Uh, so weapon wise, we're not too bad. We've got a laser pistol and I made a bunch of uh, laser pistol cells with that. And we've got a laser rifle and I've got a bunch of laser rifle cells. So we're mainly going to be using the laser equipment because I love that stuff. And we'll use the pulse rifle for, uh, I don't know. <laughs> destroying doors or something. Um, <clears throat> we also have a plasma cannon with us with a bunch of cannon cells. We have a little bit of healing. Not much. Uh, so I think let's just go do it. Let's go do it. Um, not sure why I got that multi-tool on me. Put that in there. Okay. So... Let's make sure we are set to home base in the whole, or not whole mole, but the, uh, um, right here. So let's go into our control panel, into the dart, and yep, we've got this set to our home. I think I did that earlier. I just wanted to confirm before we head down. Okay, as soon as we jump down, everything's going to spawn. Whew, here we go. Okay, what I'm hoping for is, let's put our jetpack on, turn our light on, make sure we've got that loaded. Good. Love these things. Uh, I didn't have a laser upgrade with me, kit with me, or else I would have made it a T2. It's still going to be... Okay, here we go. So... Let's see how we're going to do this. Can we automatic door right there? Will it open? Automatic door. I thought I had it there for a second. Automatic door. No, other faction. Okay, so this is where... <sighs> can I damage the target? Yes, I can. Can't I? Pretty sure I can. I think it just because the recoil made me hit the other thing. Let's, yeah, it's almost dead. It's almost dead. Okay. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> ha! They tried running from me. Ha <laughs> ha! Yeah, dart! Get him! Look at that! Awesome! Huh. Okay. Nice! That was pretty epic. Come on up, boys! Come on up, boys! Damn! Yeah, run out right when I got a face shot on him. That's... Whoa! Okay, how many are there? Love that! <laughs> Reload. Thanks! Thank you, Dart! Okay, that was pretty crazy. Let's get some... Uh... Why can't I go in? Uh, I was stuck there. That was weird. Not sure what that was all about. 
Is there any spawners nearby can I deal with? Maybe I should just blow the fuel up. You know what? Let's do it. Did that work? Did that work? No. There's fuel somewhere else? That's fine. Okay. I guess we run in. Spawner. Guns. Where's guns? Guns, guns. Gotta look out for guns. Spawner. Let's take out the spawner. Okay. How are we doing on health? Let's do a bandage. Okay, there should be another spawner right around here somewhere. For the Xerox, right? Excellent. Okay. Isn't there any guns? I thought there was some guns that I just... Did they remove them? I thought there were sentry guns. Okay. Not sure. See, I thought there was a sentry gun right here. Maybe not. Maybe I'm thinking of another POI. Okay. Okay. Okay, we're doing okay. We're doing okay. So parking the that was awesome with the uh, <laughs> with the freaking <laughs> cannon turret right there. I did that on purpose. Obviously, I parked it right there, hoping that my cannon turret would come in useful, and it was extremely useful. Probably saved my life, actually, to tell you the truth. I, I mean, I might have been in trouble there without my cannon turret. Uh, okay, well, this is awesome. So now we got to blow these doors, I guess. I should have made some C4. I guess what I can do is... What I can do... Jump out of here. <laughs> Next. Come on. Next. No? Okay. I don't want to blow up all the gear. So let's switch to the, my laser here. Oh, you're an idiot, buddy. Nice, okay. I don't really use the, uh, the small pistol rounds, but I think we can put them in deconstructor. I'm not sure though. Okay, so there's the core right there. I guess we could just blow the core, right? Ooh, good. I need the sathium. That's nice. Okay. Yeah, let's do that. Let's just blow the core. I think we can just sneak in and get in between here. <laughs> There we go. Perfect. <laughs> yeah, I know that's a bit of an exploit, but you can actually do that. <laughs> uh, okay, so the core is gone. I'm not sure if there's guys upstairs. Let's take a look. We're going to just spawn our drone really quick. And we'll go up. Oh, well, there's a spawner. 
So they may have come. They might have come downstairs. They might have spawned and come downstairs, and then I popped the core before they respawned. Yeah, there's another spawner here. <clears throat> Couple of them. Oh, a bunch of them. Okay, so uh, interesting. Interesting. So this would be this actually the power station would be ideal for one of those admin ones where you make the uh, um, that that one door only openable to the core room by uh, by switches that you got to come up here and deal with and then so like a switch inside there a switch down below right give uh, know it all DM some evil plans. He's probably already this this would actually be a tough POI with with the right little tweaks. Right? Because it's got a spawner there, spawner there. Yep. Yep. Is there a spawner inside too? I didn't see one. I didn't see one inside there, but that's it's irrelevant at this point. Okay, so Let's just head back out to the, uh, well, we die of oxygen depletion. We'll, we'll just head back to the dart. And make a core, pop that in. That wasn't so bad. That's what I mean by easy, easy POIs to start with. So that was an easy POI. There's uh, the next one we're doing is actually easier. Okay, so let's um, you know how close is that? How close is that? We can let's just let's just fly over there and do it. Let's just and then off camera or you know what? No, we're gonna hang on. Let's build the core, pop it in. We can grab the loot. Then we'll fly over. <laughs> Okay, so let's go in here and we'll grab one of these guys. We'll build a core. We'll just put it into, yeah, back into itself. That's fine. It should fit. Yep. Okay. Okay. And we'll get some oxygen. Get some oxygen. Hang on. Let's jump out. Get some oxygen. We'll we'll uh, eat something. Actually, the only food I got with me is the uh, is my emergency rations, which is fine. I'll do that. That healed me up too. <laughs> oh yeah, right. They heal fifty. They're pretty good for that. Okay, core should be ready. No, not quite. Oh, wait, that's not the box. There it is. Okay. We'll grab that. And then... We should be able to just... We should be close enough once we're standing on it to also Wi-Fi. Yeah, we can Wi-Fi to the uh, ship from here. Come on, get in. Come on, come on. Um, there, should we just stick it? Well, I guess we could put it just back, right back in its own little hidey hole where it was. <laughs> sure, let's do that. Can I fit it in there? Will it let me? Yeah, oh, I had it. I saw it there for a second. There we go. And, yeah. So, oh, I guess I nuked all the fuel. I don't care. I've got lots of Promethium. That's fuel is the least of my worries. Okay, so now that we're standing on it, we've got Wi-Fi to it. Uh, let's take a look, see what it's got. And power station. So we're gonna put that stuff into the dark. We've got some room here. Let's just. Uh, So we should stack that up with what it can do. And then we'll just take a look at what else it's got here. And we'll put the, I'm just putting the uh, mats together. 
Taking a look at what it's got. Oh, good, some healing, nice. And another advanced constructor. Some uh, auto miner cores, nice. Excellent. Most, most of the cargo box stuff will just be direct transfer over. Actually, I'll, I'll clean this up in a bit. We'll, we'll just grab everything. Let's just grab everything. We'll just grab everything. And then the, actually the big stuff, the big stuff will, um, oh, that's not big stuff. We'll just keep putting it in here. There's a bunch of blocks in there already, so. Uh, it's getting full, though. Yeah, darn. Okay, I didn't want to fill it up with blocks, so... Let's move a bunch of the this crap out. The weapons. Heals, fuel, boosts. That's a block. That's a block. I'll just leave blocks in. And mats. I think that's all just blocks and mats now. Yeah. Okay. Okay, uh, let's put this stuff into... There we go. Ten thousand. Why does that weigh ten thousand? Why does that weigh ten thousand? What? But this doesn't. Oh wait, there's something. I can't scroll there. That's why. <laughs> like, why does that weigh ten thousand? Yeah, because that. And that. Okay. Uh, oh, we, yeah, the healing. So we can grab that. We're going to need that anyway. So let's grab that. Let's grab that. That'll stack. Excellent. Excellent. Very nice. And then we can put this stuff into here. That's fine. That's all good. We'll hold that. Okay. Um, nice. I think that's it then, right? We grabbed everything. Nope. Uh, blah, gun and block for now. Uh, more blocks. Okay. No armor? No heavy armor? We didn't find any armor, did we? Okay. Uh, that's fine. That's fine. We did good, though. We got uh, another furnace. Uh, short, range, short range warp. That's interesting. That's cool. More of the uh, drill modules. Um, some upgrade kits, a uh, auto miner core, which is really important. I'm going to be using those to make uh, teleporters. Um, so I'm going to. I don't really use auto miners. I think they're kind of a waste of time if you have depletion turned on. So, because literally it takes the same amount of time to mine it out as it does to go place the core or the, mi the auto miner and then come back later for it. Oh, come on. Really? Oh, come on. Okay. Why am I not lining up here? Let's line up. <laughs> oh, what? Okay. Hang on. Let's go like this. Then we can go... There. Double jump. There we go. <laughs> the door was bonking us and stopping us. Okay, um, let's head over there, and we'll do that one. See what it has for loot, and call it an episode. This one should be pretty quick and easy.
Although, getting up to speed in this thing, for some reason, why are we slowing down? That was weird. Come on. It's very loud. Very, very, very loud. I know you guys can't really hear it. What's going on there? Did I miss something? No, we're getting there. We're getting there. This thing's really not designed to be a, a transport, planetary transport. It's not... It's not really what it was meant for originally. Okay. So, we can do the same thing. We can park... There's only one spawner left, I think, and that's up top inside so we can do the we can park here like this let's um yeah let's get up oops what's going on here there we go and we'll just park You know what? I'm going to move a little bit further back so that my cannon turret can get a better angle. I think. Yeah. There we go. Okay, so what are we like on armor? We're okay. We've got a bunch of health and stuff. We'll uh, grab some oxygen on the way. Okay, let's go do this. Let's go do this. Okay. Oops. Where am I going? Wrong way. Wrong way. And why am I not in first person? There we go. And let's grab our laser. And temperature and everything's fine, yep. Usually the moon's okay for medium armor, um, especially when you've got a couple of armor boosts going on. Okay, they're going to come out as soon as I get close. So what I want to do is I want to shoot. Nice. <laughs> Okay. Is there not a spawner up there? Uh, maybe not. Maybe there's a spawner inside. Oh, yeah. Spawner inside. Spawner inside. Okay. So let's... Can my gun see it? Yep. So if we go like this. Just want to get an angle. Okay. So let's let's try something here. Not really too cared worried about blowing crap up. Although there is a there's an epic there, I think. You know what? That's fine. That's fine, let's... It's taken a couple of blows from the plasma. It shouldn't require much. Okay, there we go. Here we go. Come on, guys. Come on out. Come on. <laughs> ah. 
Oh. Yeah. Oh. Let's go like this. Where's the spawner? There it is. So is that it then for this one? That that might be it for this one. Just that one guy. And the uh and the Oh. Uh huh. Okay, where's the core? Let's deal with the core then. Since it looks like a un Destroyable spawner down below. Oh, here's the core. Oops. Let's switch guns. Oh, oh, oh. Why is that not shooting at me? Oh, it is now. Not a <laughs> it. Just I saw it, and then he saw me. We're like, oh, damn. Finish that off. Nice. Okay. No more core. So stuff should no longer spawn. Nice. Let's grab his stuff. And oh, yeah, I should have grabbed that right away. And we'll see what he had. And yeah, we'll take his stuff. And we'll just as a cursory look. Nice. So mats and mats and mats and mats. Well, the, it's the magnesium powder that's really exciting here, to tell you the truth. So, excellent. And then there's two, there's actually two other ones. Did I, I didn't blow it up by accident, did I? Let's take a look. Let's take a look. Nope, it's right here. Nice. And then auto monitor core, a couple more laser drills, T2. Okay. Uh, and then there's one more. One more. Where is it? I think it's in here. Yeah. Uh, nice. So some more sathium, another furnace. So we're gonna we're gonna strip down these furnaces, I think, in the uh, T2 shotgun. So there's stuff to sell. No armor though. But I think once I sell all the stuff, I should be able to buy some armor. I'm hoping. I'm really hoping. I need I need heavy armor because we can't keep doing POIs like this in medium armor. Well, guys, hopefully uh, you like this episode. I'm going to call it here. Uh, there we go. We've done a couple of POIs. I'm going to strip. I'm going to mine these out, or not mine them out. I'm going to loot them. Um, and you know, for for right now, I don't think I'm going to bother with taking all the blocks because I don't really need to. Uh, I will take the fuel though. So let's let's take a look to see what it's got for fuel and and uh, won't be much. Yeah, a little piddling amount. And then oxygen. Nope, not enough to take. Okay. Okay, well. Uh, I don't think I'm going to actually... I don't care about any of the other parts. Nothing. I don't even care about anything. I'm just going to grab the loot containers. The items out of the loot containers and get the hell out of here. So... Yeah. Next episode. Um, hmm. Good question. Next episode. I really need Sathium. I do really need Sathium. We've got the Magnesium now. And we are 25th level. <sighs> this thing just isn't working for a mining vehicle for me. It's a combat space combat vehicle. It's not working for I, it's really hard to get the whole mole in and out like super difficult it's it's really kludgy um if i'm in a panic mode this is not going to work for me so i either multi-tool this down and build a new cv or i just build another cv leave this up at the base for when you know what let's do that we're going to build another cv we're going to start on another cv it's going to be a cargo slash mining cv that's what it's going to be. Uh, and I actually, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to make it look like the whole mole. I'm going to make the whole mole's big big brother in a CV form. Uh, yeah, I think that should be awesome. And then the whole mole can just like slip right in its, um, we'll park it in the hangar. 
<laughs> yeah. Yeah. Nice. Okay, well, I'm going to finish looting this thing. And cause all I got to do is just connect to one of the, um, uh, what are we going to connect to? I guess we'll connect to this one and take all the blocks. Okay, guys. Well, next episode, hopefully I'll have what it takes. You know what? I might strip these down for the blocks so that we can deconstruct them for the Sathium. And, um, yeah, not that we're going to need a ton of Sathium because it's going to be a cargo slash mining vehicle. But so it's going to be mainly made out of iron. But uh, it'll need some Sathium for the thrusters. So I think we need more than what we looted. Um, so yeah, I'm going to take a bunch of these blocks, I think, because this is hardened steel, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. So there we go. This place is hardened steel. We can get uh, hard, we can get Sathium out of I think we can deconstruct the blocks and get hardened steel out of them. So that's what we're going to try. So next episode, uh, I'll have this done. I'll be back at the base. I'll have some more base work done on the interior hangar with all the lighting and stuff. And then uh, we'll get started on building a proper mining slash hangar or slash uh, cargo CV. So until then, you guys have yourselves an awesome, awesome day.